All right, guys. Uh, we'll pull up our second stop here. Well, I'm pretty sure we're at the fish market. But I hate walking around with the camera, especially because I don't look like I'm from here. And I don't like having cameras on people's faces. Let's so I'm going to give it to Fejai. Here, Fejai. What's up? They, they don't think it's as weird when you walk around with the camera. Oh, OK. Hey, move. So what's and going on? And I'm not on? wearing a tank top to show off. I just don't have any more clothes. We need, we need to do laundry. And uh, we never had the time to do it. There's not much to show off anyways. No. have an idea look there's cars everywhere and they're just waiting for their fish yeah I think he is the same because there's no lights there's no is this is this a stop sign <laughs> but this is a stop for the fish maybe Sam is just walking he doesn't even know where he's going let's go over here I saw something crazy here what is that dude where oh these are salt water oh, oh those are triggers yeah Yeah, they don't look very good. Oh wow, sturgeon. See it? Is it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Look right there. That's how they transport fish from one place to another. Huh? Okay. He said there's there's more. That's why he went that way. Okay. Well, let's just show the sturgeon. The whole thing is full of sturgeon. They look healthy though. They don't look as beat up as the other guys. But if he said there's more that way, it's probably better fish that way, so let's go check it out. Right here, this is the seafood market. You know, obviously everything's for food. So these are uh, albino tilapies. Yeah, right? I don't think it's albino, it's just a, a color morph, like a find them. Yeah, you can see the, 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 the meat. The meat. Yeah. Wow. Look at this, dude. Look at the size of this Chinese perch. Yeah, I think you have to speak up a little bit because of the noise. Alright, you know these fish more than me. Dude, they even have short body fish for food. Yeah, so this is the fish market and Chinese perch is actually uh, a very tasty... Whoa, whoa. <laughs> it's a very tasty uh, a fish, so um, it's, it's consumed a lot here in China. They also get pretty big, that's why, right? You got big head carp. But short body. But short though. body. You would think for food you would want a big body so there's more meat. Right. Oh, remember they said that the best part of the fish is the cheek. Oh, maybe yeah. they're baiting less. Yeah, they that. don't want. Ah, yeah. see, I'm not that I'm smart. Okay. Now jaguar cichlids. I didn't know this. This was a food. Well, I figure cichlids, especially the ones that get big. But I, I know a few people. They'll probably love to have one. These are good quality too. Look at the markets. Yeah. So now, anybody who wants uh, large jaguar cichlids, we, we know where to get them. I think the biggest problem is to ship that back to the U.S. We're talking at least, what, four, per, three per box? I think four per box. Four per box, and it's still a very pricey fish. Yeah, correct. Big ass tilapia. Oh. Wait, did he buy a Chinese perch? I'm not we're having I'm, lunch. I'm not eating we're fish, bro. I, I mean, no, I ate fish. Doesn't before. that look like masir? Yes, they're eating masir too. Damn. All right, how about this, big guy? Let's find a fish to rescue. Okay. Oh, just one. Just one. Just one. All right. So we good. don't have bags. We don't. We might. Have, well, know. we'll walk the market and we'll see who needs our help. Yep. And we'll, we'll bring it up and maybe you'll be a part of it. Hey, come here. We need to rescue one fish. Okay, okay. okay. all right, we're gonna rescue one fish, guys. So, we're gonna walk around and see what is the number one fish here. If we don't find anything crazy, I'm gonna rescue this guy. All right, sounds good, but I think there's more. Oh, what was that guy? oh, this is a regular channel cat, right? Yeah. All right, let's follow him. So, you want to explain to them? Usually, Sam or his partner goes in front of us, right? Yeah. To ask for permission so we can film because we're outsiders. 
and a lot of them don't want to film this. But I think for, in the food market, hey, it shouldn't be so big of a concern. Wow, these are flounders. There's a, there's a couple of flounders that are actually freshwater too. Yeah, there's different types. I just got splashed oh, all over by this guy. But look at the size of those barramundis. How big do you think they are? This one, at least 30 inches. That's crazy. Hello. Hello. How are you? Yeah. And say, this say hello? Yeah. 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 Alright, they're waiting inside. <laughs> That's the second person. Hold on, hold on. That's the second person that fist bumped you out of nowhere last night and uh, <laughs> there upon my neck. It's just crazy to see the, the fish that we love so much for food, but it's normal. Like they're food in their country as well. There's a lot of uh Barramundi farms that breed them for food. But girl, if we had our own facility like a, 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 a zoo, not a zoo, an aquarium here. We can get all these fish just from the fish market. Exactly. That's wild. They're right. all raised in huge ponds. I think right now my big is the the, the, the hydrant Do you agree with me? So far, yes. Yeah. Okay. There could be something else. There could be something else. Let's go check it out. We might have to rescue more than one. Yeah, now we're talking big guys. All right, we got to be careful not to get wet here. It's a local fish delivery. I don't want to get splashed. Move, 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 move. It's already all... I'm gonna have to fish shit all over my toes. We're gonna have to sanitize our feet here. Get out of the way, get out of the way. This is kind of chaotic here, because we're trying to film for you guys and try not to get run over, trying not, not to get wet. There's too many aspects. Oh, now he wants to come in here. Yeah, this is, these are Mashiers. A Chinese variant of a uh, Mashiers. Yeah, they got like a gold fin. Yeah, yeah. Alright, let's go inside. Maybe we'll find something else. It's really loud. Yeah, so... What are those? I don't think I've seen them before. Oh. They, at first, I thought they were approach, some type of approach a lotus, but it's not. I think these are... I don't know what it is. I like them. You like them? We're trying to we're trying to look over all these stands to see if we find a flat or a vinyl fish hidden. Hey Jai, look, 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 look. We need some of these, bro. These are uh, what I call a Chinese tarpon. Yes. They have the same mouth structure, the underjaw, and everything. We had one uh, golden one. Remember? Yeah. It didn't grow. Golden one, yeah. It didn't grow at all. But these are pretty big. So now that I see what they look like, I want to get somewhere around like five, six inches. What do you think? I'll ask him. Did he size Yes. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're getting, we're bringing to you. Not these, so smaller because these would be very expensive and great. What's that over there? They look really nice too. Arrow barbs. Arrow barbs. But not the, not the white ones. The regular color yeah. ones. I didn't know the scales looked like that. Oh, this looks like a regular tarpon. No, th th it's the same fish. Oh wow. So it is a it is an Asian tarpon. All right, you guys want an Asian tarpon? It's coming soon. It's really interesting. Seeing the arrow barb in its natural color, and like you said, you didn't know that they had scales like that. No. Remember the the, the albino one that we got the other day in the market, yeah. and it had like that sparkly to the scale. Yeah. So that just means that as it grows, it's going to develop that. So it will get really pretty good as it gets older. Look. Look at the skins. I wouldn't mind having big ones in the tank, right? Alright, we're going to another place. Okay. It's fish on both sides, everywhere, the whole entire street. <coughs> At least it's not super hot, right? He should have warned us and got us like those boots to wear. Or, what, or the crops he's wearing. He still should be getting wet. The guy's <laughs> getting splashed left to right here. Here, but oh, look at that. It's 
What do you think? I like this. Yeah, I think we should take some. That's a different type of fruit. Yeah, there, there's many types. Um, this is probably the, the one green. that. Yeah, the green. So the green is more long and slender. This is uh, like the one that's uh, the piebald, the, the black and white one at the shop. Let's see that. that yeah. one is long and slender right there. Yeah. It's the, the it's the leopard perch. The leopard perch. Okay. I really like this fish. I think we should get them like four inches. Oh, wow. This we place, found, okay. Sorry. This place right here is specialized in polar fish. You can see this American paddlefish right here. And even being in the stink, his nose is pretty good. Look. Yeah. So they're probably raised in smaller, in small setups. Well, this is what I was trying to tell you, because I remember when we came to this market last time, I remember them being really crowded and being okay. I think once they, they're settled and they have their bearings, then they, they, they're okay. What, what? <laughs> well, uh, no, well, uh, uh, well, all right, I'll show you guys. White sturgeons, are they, are they, they're not albino, so their eyes are black, so I guess it's a platinum. Platinum sturgeon. Okay, that white sturgeon, what about you? I don't know. But it's not albino, the eyes are black. So it's a white sturgeon. It's a white one, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, but that one is the whitest. Uh -huh. That one right there. Yeah. Oh, how are you doing? This guy looks like Gary. Does he? Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Damn. Big guy. What's your pick? I like the loach. Loach? Alright, so we're gonna stick to the loach. Oh, the sturgeon, man. Holy shit. Bro, what is it? Look at that eel. We need that, that eel. Depends what species it is. Wow. Fresh water. If it was white, it'd be nicer. Oh, no, that's not the belly. Every time I see a white fish, I'm like, it's the belly. <laughs> I guess they, they feel the weight of the fish and they just throw it to the right tanks. I get well, si they're sizing it, baby. Where are we going now? We're gonna have lunch. Wait, oh, we're gonna eat that fish? Yeah. <laughs> you gotta try it. We're both at home. But they look so bad here. Huh? Well, that's the whole point when you put something in. Oh, these are mice and shrimp. You eat shrimp, right? You want mice and shrimp? Not this mice and the, shrimp. I'll eat regular oh, shrimp. Oh, no, sorry. This, uh, this is not mice and shrimp. This is called, um, I forgot what it's called. Anymore. Pesto shrimp? Um, mantis. Mantis shrimp. Mantis, yeah. I forgot that, too. Look at that. Yeah, that's the grouper we had. Yeah. Are you going to eat it? You want to try it? No, I'll do regular shrimp like this. <laughs> regular shrimp? You get that in the U.S. Oh, how about that? Wow. That's so cool. I think that's the tiger pond. Yeah. This is really nice too. I think people will put that in a tank. Look at these crabs. Jeez, even the yeah, even the lobsters look good, bro. Look at these lobsters. Yeah, these are Pacific lobsters. They don't have claws. They can probably take slightly warmer water too. You may be able to keep them. Can he ship? Can he export lobster? I'll ask him. Yeah. These are all salt water, but I just came across this tank here too. Now look what's in here. A big old snakehead. Right there, that one is albino and ready. <laughs> He's waiting for you. No, 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 you, Sam? Sam? Yeah. Yeah. Anytime. Yeah. <laughs> Walking around, they picked 
shrimp and a Chinese perch to eat. Yep, so we're, we've encountered a problem. The restaurants are closed. You, typically the way it works here is you can go into the market, pick your own seafood, and then you bring it to these restaurants here and they'll cook it for you. So it's the freshest possible seafood that you can get. But ah. we were a little bit late today. We overslept or we slept in today and uh, the restaurants closed. They closed midday and then they reopen at night again. Okay, okay. So we're walking around with fresh seafood. <laughs> we might have to do sashimi today. <laughs> uh, I, I don't know about that.